The purpose of the study was to decide which one of the three medications was the best initial monotherapy as determined by giving the best seizure control with the fewest intolerable side effects and the least effects on attention over the first 16 to 20 weeks of therapy. 32 medical centers collaborated for the first time ever to study kids with newly diagnosed epilepsy. Childhood absence epilepsy is the most common form of pediatric epilepsy. The seizures that occur in kids with childhood absence epilepsy are frequent, brief staring spells, often with eye fluttering and unresponsiveness. They can occur dozens to hundreds of times a day with a sudden onset, a period of unresponsiveness, and then a sudden return to consciousness. My name is Maximilian Dole. I'm 13, I'll turn 14 right after the spring break. Max is a great example of a typical child with childhood absence epilepsy. Normal development, enthusiastic, energetic, and full of life. Max had been experiencing symptoms for a while, but we weren't sure that they were seizures at the time. He had the eye blinking. He had moments where he was staring off into space. And in fact, for a while, we thought maybe he might have an attention problem. I mean, you feel like you're a little bit behind everybody else. We had to make sure that people knew that he was having seizures because there was always the potential for injury when the seizures were not controlled. The main result of the trial was that ethosuximide gave the best combination of seizure control, lack of intolerable side effects, and fewest effects on attention compared to valproic acid and lamotrigine. We were really ecstatic to find out that we had a drug that worked and he was well on his way to a recovery, I guess is how you would put it. Even with the best drugs, approximately half the patients did not get initial seizure control with their first medication. Overall, approximately 65 to 75 percent of children were able to get complete seizure control without intolerable side effects by either their first or second medication. Now, after he's seizure-free, the that weight that sits on your shoulders, that worry, is gone. We have taken the first step, and this is an exciting journey that these medical centers are all working together to achieve the best care for our patients.